Hello there ladies and gentlemen, Sigla here, welcome back to our video. So we got the April full sale and so we're gonna talk about it. We got some chests here and do we have anything in these special offers? Uh, we look to have, be having something, I'm trying to look over the cat at the moment. It's okay, he will move shortly, there we go. Yeah, there's only one offer. So yeah, we're gonna talk about those and then I'm gonna open something myself because I actually need one of those things. First up, power-up chest. We're gonna have a power-up chest for Beast Boy. This is to get gears for Beast Boy. I recommend this for everybody who has a gearless Beast Boy because while you can make him work without gears, only one gear is all you need to get him to 2 billion damage because he needs two things, max crit chance and max crit damage. And now that we can take gears all the way to level 80, with one gear your Beast Boy can probably reach max crit chance and max crit damage. So that is what I'm gonna open on my uh, secondary account. And honestly, open them one by one until you get the gear. You don't need to go overboard with this because Beast Boy is that strong that he only requires one single gear to tremendously boost your damage up. As soon as you have max crit chance and max crit damage, if you're not doing 2 billion damage, then you need a bit higher passive stats and that specific soul rate. But again, this is huge. One more gear is all you need for him. Get your Beast Boy gear. Whatever it is, doesn't matter. I mean, ideally you would get the crit chance one, but hey, that requires some luck. Next up we have the Orm power-up chest. Bro, look, Orm, in my opinion, is a character that you should be looking into if you're into collecting things. If you're at the point where you want to have every single character in the game and you got Orn somehow and you don't have gears for him, by all means, get his gear chest on sale, get his gears. But other than that, other than for entertainment and collection purposes, there's absolutely no reason for you to get this man. He is easily top 3 worst legendary characters in the game. You don't need him and you don't need his gears on your account. This is a waste of gems. Do not make any attempt to open this, please. Unless, yet again, you're swimming in gems. You just want to get your gears for your boy Orn. In that case, whatever, man. You do you. Now, we're going to also take a look at this. This is April's full lucky chest. So, this is gonna have chances for Beast Boy and chances for Orm. Do we have any other legendary chests I can give, for example, in the store? No, we don't. No, we don't. But, uh, yeah, this is literally the chances you get for a usual Beast Boy legendary chest. Uh, and uh, it's gonna be a bit cheaper than that, because that's usually 420. This is gonna be 375, so you're getting pretty much uh, a Beast Boy legendary chest on a very small discount. Now, it also dropped Orm, which is bad, which is not something you're looking for. I think recently we had a chest that was exactly like this and was shared between uh, uh, Beast Boy and Scorpion. That was a lot better than this. This is kind of worse than that because of Orm, a lot worse than that because of Orm. Uh, but at the same time, if you're gonna get your, if you're eager to get yourself a Beast Boy anyway, you can simply think of this as a Beast Boy legendary chest on like, I don't even know what the percentage is, it's a bit higher than 10%, it's like a 15% chance or something like that legendary Beast Boy chest on sale and randomly drops you purple garbage, which is Orm Shard, so I guess you can think about it that way if you really want beast boy this is not the worst thing you can buy there are better things but this is the usual legendary beast boy chest with a 15 percent sale that's how i see it orm does not exist for me over here but yet again if you don't have none of them and you want to collect both of them have more legendaries have all the legendaries and you're missing the specific two then this is obviously a pretty good chest but other than that, don't think of this as a Beast Boy plus Orm chest. Think of this as a legendary Beast Boy chest on a 15% sale. And if you want to grab it, grab it. If you want to wait for a better deal, then wait for a better deal. Now let's take a look at the special offers as well. So we got April's Fool's Lucky Bundle. This is going to cost about $25, I think. And it's going to have a 15% chance... Uh, for Orm and a 15% chance for Beast Boy, you can gamble up to five times. Again, 
this is what I usually say about those things. Do not buy gamble bundles. Also, I think this is very stupid here because you can randomly maybe get one of them and you can randomly maybe get random gear. Let's say you get Orm and you get Beast Boy's feet. What are you going to do at that point? Yeah, I really don't like gamble bundles. The only use for this is if you just started playing the game and you just need characters. You need characters to grind the nine champions, right? It's going to give you a couple of characters. But don't waste your money gambling for this. And as far as gambling goes, there are better gambles to do in just to mobile than this if you want to gamble your money away. This is truly April's Fool's Bundle to an extent. This is this is the most fitting thing out of this sale. But yeah, let's move on to the secondary account and get myself hopefully one gear for Beast Boy. Okay, let's open those bad boys up. And I'm gonna open them one by one. Oh, I actually have a more limited amount of gems than I thought I do. What is this? This is XP capsules. This is garbage. Come on, give me gears. Give me gear. Give me goddamn gear. Ah, uh, credits. Come on. Got four more chances. Materials. Only one gear. That's all I need. One gear, buddy. One gear. Come on. Uh, materials. What's the chance exactly to get anything? So it's a 15% in total. Come on, buddy. Come on, we got two more chances to go. Ah, oh, credits again. Come on, last try. Please, please give me a gear for Beast Boy. I don't want to play my Be Beast Boy gearless anymore. Come on. Oh, this is sad. This is sad. Let me, let me see if I can get together a bit more gems to open one more. Nah, bro, I just collected my gems from uh, the uh, Soul Raid because I forgot to collect them today and we're at 200. And if I watch all the 10 goddamn ads, I'm gonna be at 250. It's over, it's over for this account. This is gonna be up for three days, so maybe I'll do a couple more one openings and I'll let you know in like a Soul Raid video uh, if I do get this or not. And also, since we're right here, because there might be some people grabbing other things in the store, I just remembered. This is a bad League of Arnica chest, because if we take a look at this... Uh, we got... we got... Uh, where, where are they? they? They got pretty low chances overall, and this chance is to get, like, random amounts of... Did they change the chest? Yeah, I think they changed it somewhat, because they got the base chance of getting uh, 160 here, and then the chances that you would usually get for a normal gold shard chest. And then we got Joker with a 2% TPI with a 2%. My point is, there's a chest that costs 400. When you want to buy League of Arcade chest, look at the one that costs 400, not the one that costs 300, because it has far better chances to get yourself League of Arcade characters. And I mean, if you want gears for them, there's the gear chest. Which has actually has a lot better. Uh, you can also only drop gears for them, so that's gonna be a lot more fair than what what I went through with Beast Boy. But yeah, sadly, my Beast Boy is, is probably gonna gonna see gears for a while. I wish you better luck than I had. And with all being said, I'll see you all in the next one. Bro, one gear. That's all I was asking for, but only one. Come on. But yeah, goodbye.